economic stimulus package of 2009. When we open this building uh, in a little over a year from now, it will represent the culmination of over 10 years of trying to find a new home for the carpenters. There has been a constant vision of this project throughout the lengthy search process. We've looked for a site in the Boston area near public transportation that has sufficient parking and in a highly visible location. We finally found all of that here at 750 Dorchester Avenue. The new Carpenter Center will combine all the elements that make up our organization, training, servicing, organizing, and benefit funds, as well as a branch of the First Trade Union Bank. It will be a one-stop center that will hopefully be a source of pride and opportunity for our members for years to come. For those of us who are lucky enough to both work and live in the city of Boston, we are fortunate to have a mayor and administration that understands the value of economic development. Mayor Menino has never wavered in his support for union construction. He knows that when we work, Boston works. I'd like to introduce the mayor of Boston, Tom Menino. Thank the uh, New England Regional Council of Commons for a lot of things they do. Uh, you really make a difference in improving the resources in our community. We want people off the bench, banging nails, out there working every day. That's why I work with this union and all the unions, all the building trades, to make sure we put men and women on the job, off the bench, making sure they're working hard make Boston a better city. Uh, we very much want to be your partners in getting through this, um, this economic uh, downturn and preparing us for the very bright future that we have working together in, uh, in Massachusetts. So I'm, I'm looking forward to, uh, to uh, picking up that sledgehammer. I love the idea of breaking down walls. I love the, uh, the, uh, the growth opportunity that it signifies. So thanks very much for having us. There are not words to tell you how much I appreciate your endurance, your willingness and your commitment to Boston, your willingness to find a location that really works. But most of all, I am so grateful today to be here to celebrate years and years of giving by the Carpenters. Leadership that's been here has always been about giving and making a difference. And how proud and how grateful are each of us on this stage to be able to stand with you today and celebrate your commitment to creating a training center, to bringing everyone together, to making a difference for labor, and to giving a real fabulous message as people drive that Southeast Expressway, that Boston, is still the labor town of this country. And we are so proud.